that. Don't be a stranger. Feeling a little troubled, but good day, all the same. Eivor. I cleared Winchester of the Order. Yet to do so meant working with King Alfred. Your poor fellow soldier led you to the King of Wessex? How very strange. He, or she, is toying with you, it seems. I have to go. Then go in peace. Eivor! A good day to you! Eivor, Altergate? The Order in Winchester has been wiped out, but we are no longer welcome there. My contact was none other than King Alfred himself. The Order wanted him dead. So he fought back. Alfred, the line between friend and enemy is a porous one. I want to see the Alliance map. What of Essex? We received a summons from the Elderman and his Lady of Colchester, requesting you specifically for a matter of great secrecy. Foreboding. And who is this Elderman? One of King Alfred's lackeys. According to my scouts, he is a man who cares more for his own indulgences than the safety of his people. Approach with care. I will leave at once. An alliance in Essex would be invaluable, but go with caution. You return. I've completed my training. So you have. Walk with me. I have been busy while you have been running around. The last of the rock has been cleared. Now you will see the full entryway. This was here the whole time. We built our settlement so close to it and had no idea. There are no coincidences when the gods are involved. Everything happens as needed. I cannot see how to open it. That is because Freya built it so that only someone with the strength and will of the Allfather himself could open it. Ah, so that is why you put me through so many trials. Exactly. Now, take this and hold it aloft.
we have come for. Reach out and take the orb, Eivor. Good. Now hand it to me. What does it do? This is Odin's eye. It will act as a compass for us to find our next location. Next location? This wasn't the treasure you needed. I do need it. It will lead us to Odin's vault. I feel like I've been used. Maybe you have. But you are stronger and now have access to my weapons and armor. Seems like it was worth it. Continue to train. Hoogerheim will always be open to you. Visit me should you wish to see my collection again. Aid me, be my eyes. Ha! Eivor of the Raven Clan. The Eye of Odin will serve our purpose. I have discovered the secret of the Eye. What can you mean? It is one thing to look upon it, but quite another to listen. It will sing to you, Wolfkist. It will sing of treasure. You speak in riddles. Take it. Hold it close. Go to the coast of East Anglia. Once there, follow the song. You will see. I am to listen to an eye with my ears. <laughs> I fear you mock me. There is no mockery. Go. You will understand. Can you remind me what you can help me with? I am in Ravensthorpe to train you and to trade treasures for any battle energy you have collected. The Eye of Odin will direct you to objects of the gods using sounds. I should get going. Goodbye. Off we go. More sail! Let's hear a story. Let's have a song. You Salskulls got a story. Quiet a moment and listen to my tale of the king in the east, who showers gold upon his warriors from Norway and Gautland. He be named Basel of Greece. 
the yard of all yards, and even his bathing tub is forged of gold. Use the oars! But such oh, wealth shame. draws enemy. Every day, his yarrows and veins are blotted for his life. Take the mouth down! Using poison, arrows, and blades. Basel lived in fear. One day, Basel was bathing in his golden tub when his enemies attacked. Naked, Basel left out a window into the streets. There, he met by chance a warrior and trader. Sail. The just warrior saved the naked man from the attackers. Grateful, Basel gave this man gold and made him his chief thane that day. But it is a poor leader that lacks loyal warriors. So they formed the Varangian Guard to serve as Basel's loyal retainers. Let's sail, Sir Bruce, no. Sail out! Basel trusts these men, for they are not Greek and cannot take his hand. But it is a poor king that can't keep a throne. Go, my eyes. You are unable to open a simple door. Your singing stone tells me something is within, but the door will not move. Have you still the amulet of Freya? Oh, you burden me with so much jewelry. You may have fooled Freya, but your strength is no match for Odin. You mean to say that I must continue to train? New shrines of Hugarheim await you. If you like, come visit me. I have more treasures to bestow. Meanwhile, keep this. There may be other hidden playthings of the gods. Sunen, guide me. It's 
seems Elderman Beerston has made this ruin his longhouse. Perhaps because you have drunk the barrel dry? Damn, beer stand. His household is as poorly run as his land. Estrid is a good wife. Far better than he deserves. You would say that, Adrian. Your wife acts like a sow in a skirt. My sweater run is a worthy woman, you coxcomb. But she's an excellent cook. With a fine nose for truffles. If Beerstan does not return soon, Wine will not be the only thing spilled upon its floors. Now, gentlemen, everyone is fractious with this waiting. Let us be civil at least. Lord. Ah, a heroic-looking Dane in our midst. I am looking for Beerstan, the elderman of this shire. Our lord is not at home, but his wife is receiving visitors upstairs in her usual fashion. If you speak with her, pass on that we've run out of ale. Les Anglais sont des hommes. And they've eaten us out of hearth and home. We have but one cask of ale and two roasted pheasants left. Let us hope Birstan has at least killed a boar or two, or his stains will add inhospitality to their list of complaints. Cochon! Fifty swine! Shoot, ma chère. There is no use fretting. will come at one cry from me. Sheathe your blade, lady. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan, here at your husband's request. Another Dane. I am Estrid, wife of the Lord of Essex. As you may have heard, my lord is not at home. You do not speak as one from here. Where is your home? These rain-sodden bogs and fog-washed hills are not my home, thank Christ. I come from Francia. My grandfather walked on Frankish sod. He spoke of an appetite for conquest that rivaled our own. Sadly, my conquests are reduced to pettish thanes and graceless men. All Frankish fire extinguished. I am weary of rounding up Saxons. Is your husband stolen, drunk or wayward? He'll be stalking the woodlands today, hunting game and ignoring the vital affairs of Essex. One such affair is why we called for you. If I can find him, I will remind him of his duties. Ah, such would be a miracle. His favorite haunt is southwest of here. The lavender fields there attract the prey, God help him. With luck he hasn't been eaten, but I will return either way. Even the saints were tired of waiting for Beer Stan to hang up his bow. Dear Astrid, we must discuss the affairs of this land, with or without him. Let's get out of here.
want you! Lights out the poxy runt! Accept your will! Watch it! 
stop. Hmm. <gasps> 